Welcome to Beer Barbecue Baseball. Have another Rockwell Beer Company beer. Uh, they're based out of St. Louis, Missouri. Uh, another small craft beer um, brewery here. They're located on South Vandeventer Avenue, if you're familiar with St. Louis at all. Uh, fairly close to St. Louis University. Uh, just south of Manchester Road in the city. Um, again, it's called Standby. Um, it is 5.3% uh, alcohol by volume. Um, it's supposed to be a hoppy pilsner. So I couldn't find the IBUs on this. Um, kind of excited to try it. I have did the bird up the other, earlier uh, the other day. Really enjoyed it. I'm looking forward to trying this one. I did purchase this for $2.79. It is a 16 ounce can. And uh, they did win the bronze medal in the Great American uh, Beer Festival in 2019. So that's pretty awesome. Small little brewery for St. Louis. Um, it does say no te technical difficulties here on the can. So as you can see there, kind of looks like, you know, your TV problem, technical difficulty from the 80s. Uh, again, standby, Hoppy Pilsner. Uh, it does say crisp, snappy, and classic. So let's get into it. Getting ready to watch the NHL All-Star Game that is also here in St. Louis this year. It's a pretty beer. Uh, poured a nice head. Slightly hazy. Kind of looks like a citrusy um, Hefeweizen. Let's see what we get here. Hmm. Interesting aroma. Hmm. Smells a little bready and a little citrusy. Kind of what I was expecting. That's what most Pilsners kind of taste like these days. Um, decent carbonation there. You probably can't see it because it is hazy. Um, yeah, can't see it. Poured into a nice Pilsner glass with a baseball at the bottom. That's good. Starts out very clean, and then as you swallow, it coats the bitterness and the hoppiness, coats the back of your tongue, um, lays pretty dry back there. Maybe some Pilsner malt back there in the back as well, after you swallow. Some good lacing. Yeah, it's good. It's refreshing. Um, I would say it's definitely crisp. Um, snappy, I don't really know what a snappy beer tastes like, but okay, I'll go with it. Um, the dryness is Definitely hanging around there on the back of the tongue. Very bready when I go to when I go to drink it. Bready aroma kind of takes over. But this is uh, definitely a very good beer. This would be perfect for summer. Just your typical classic Pilsner. Um, I love that aftertaste that it leaves. They did a great job on this. Um, I haven't had a lot of Rockwell beers. As a matter of fact, I think maybe only two or three. Um, but I've been impressed so far. I'm definitely going to venture out and 
uh, get some more. I didn't, I haven't been purchasing them because a little more than I like to spend on a beer, but two seventy nine for a sixteen ouncer, that's not that bad. I want to say they used to be like three something. A lot of the local craft beer uh, from St. Louis here are three, four bucks for a can that size. So uh, at two seventy nine, I thought, what the heck, I'll go ahead and try it. So I'm glad I did. Three point seven five here from Beer Barbecue Baseball. If you've had this, um, I don't think they distribute very, very far out. So um, let me know what you think. Um, give me a thumbs up and press the like button if you would. We'll see you on the next one. Go Blues.